it's much contagious, fun. you know, and my whole idea is that you get like a viral movement like this with the youth, you know, because the people who are, who are in, in the inner city who are doing graffiti and doing all that same kind wow. of edgy where they want to get away with something. Imagine if we, they started doing more skeptical things, then it would really become a movement instead of Right, a you know, and things that are like the ducks can yeah. easily remove. And like yeah. I said, I went back to remove. Non-violent, non... Non-violent. Non non political uh, statement, political. but not exactly political. No, it's not really political. It's more just to get people to think, you know? Like, I didn't think about the quacking until you said it, but I'm a little slow sometimes, so, That's you know. That's okay. And like I said, Jeff Wag came up with, well, they were attracted because of the water. It's what? It's because it's water. Oh, yeah, God, yeah, that's the ducks land Oh, that's there. great. I didn't think of that. for the water. And I hadn't thought of that, so. Uh, you know, you, you. So what, oh, you can't tell us what's next, can you? Well, I, I'm going to do bigger and better. No, I mean, you know, probably another duck thing, not maybe not so many other things. But yeah, and then I'm, I've got a few other things planned because that was so much fun. And I was willing to take the risk of being arrested, of right. being fine. And the fact that I might not have been allowed back in France again would have been very devastating for me personally. So this was not done lightly. Littering? Littering. And desecrating your grave. Desecrating your grave. Desecrating your grave is, is a crime. It's a, but no, so to me to actually put yeah, on the line... Yeah, but the thing is, it, that's where it would pro she probably wouldn't be prosecuted because there was no damage done, but right. it was an insult to the memory of that man, you know? And you if know, the judge happened to really like Hahnemann, and his, he was a homeopathic right. person himself, then she, they might have slapped her with a huge... But the fire. media would have been great. Well, and the See, media would have been great, too. That's why when I did the thing with Bonnie Vent, I was very upset because she was saying that she was going to sue... The right. skeptic blog, and they all caved to her. And, she, and when it turned out, she didn't. She didn't have anything. She didn't have a letter. She didn't have a phone call. And yet, everybody was afraid they were going to get sued. But my thing was, if you get sued, that's the best possible thing you could do because she can't win. Because she, in order for her to win, she would have had to prove that she can have a séance with Michael Jackson, which is not provable. And if it is, it will change the entire world of science. So, you know take it to court and get some media coverage. But in the meantime, I might have lost my job and, you know. Well, that was my thing. For me, and people don't understand that, I knew there was a real, maybe an outside chance, that I would never be able to go back to France and Paris again. And I love France and Paris, but I also have business there. The surrealists would have galleries, never thought of, they would have galleries. never considered that. But I, I, yeah, but I really considered, <laughs> is this worth it for me? And I'm like, you know what? It's an outside chance, but I'm gonna. That's how you get in the history books, though. Well, I'm not sure. <laughs> Historically, she she put ducks in a grave. Well, look at Chris. Well, look at Chris Burden. Though. Rarely make history. Chris, I love it. Chris I love Burden, it. I think you're brilliant. Never see his coffee table book. It's this thing. It sells for eighty-five dollars a copy. And if you look at some of the silly stuff he did in there, it's just like yeah. So I would kind of like to see a Michael Jackson seance. Says, oh, <laughs> Michael's here. <laughs> yeah, right. Michael's here. Uh, she yeah, starts but... grabbing her crotch. Why, <laughs> Miss Michael? What We're really waiting for release new music. What it really music. turned out to be is two two phony mediums fighting over the right to say, I am the genuine Michael Jackson. I am the only one that can do Michael Jackson seances. And one of the things we were going to do is we are going to go, okay, we'll hire both of you, and both of you will do a seance at exactly the same time. Du dueling Michael. Yeah. <laughs> and In then you stereo. have, because his spirit can't possibly inhabit two mediums at the same time. So oh, whoever, oh, whoever wins. I love that. As a spirit, you can buy Yeah, right. That's true. That's probably true. They have an out for it right away. Oh, my God. I want a front row. I want front row tickets. For well, that, the worst okay? thing is, it's like I, I put in my blog: is what about Michael Jackson's family? Do they care at all? Because they're what are they? Uh, seven? No, they're Mormons. No, they're not Mormons. I don't know what they are. Jehovah's Witnesses. So in my blog, I put you know why aren't why aren't they like saying something about this? Because I would be, and they got the money to do something about it too. You know, if they wanted to say, okay, prove it. I, you know, and that's the thing. Talk about desecration. Yeah, exactly. You know, has been dead since like 1848. You know, I don't, I don't think it's current. You know, I guess it probably Joe Jackson exactly. figures any publicity is good publicity. You know, but I would be if I was a family member, I would be really pissed. I would, I would put, put down some money to take her down. Well, and you know, Joe Jackson never got one of those mugs. It's his number one dad. <laughs> yeah, right. He don't own one of those. So. No.
So he had one, but he threw it with <laughs> 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 The wrong color! <laughs>